Welcome back, kindergarten. Today is day number two of our line project. Last time I saw you, we reviewed and talked about lines that artists use. So we have zigzag, wavy, dotted, dashed, spiral, curved, thick, and thin. Today we're going to start making our project. So you could use a lined piece of paper, you could use a computer piece of paper, you could even use a piece of construction paper. Now if we were in the classroom, we'd have a fancy colored construction paper. But because some of you may not have that at home, that is okay. I have my regular piece of paper and I'm choosing whatever color I want and I am coloring in the whole paper one color. Now if you want to get creative, and that's what artists do, you could do rainbow colors, you could do stripes. I'm going to stick with my favorite color, purple. Now we have a saying in the art room, hide the paper when you color. Color in the whole paper. All right, let's pretend that I'm done with this. When you're done with this, you're going to go ahead and you're going to grab your second piece of paper. And you're going to take that paper and you're going to fold it in half, long like a hot dog roll. You're going to fold it in half again. And you're going to fold it in half one more time. You're going to open it up. And when you open it up, you'll have these creases. These creases are going to be where you draw your lines that we learned about. All right, so you can use whatever color you want to do this. All right, I have my zigzag line. I have my wavy line. I'm taking my time while doing this. I have a dotted line. I have a dashed line. Curved line, spiral line, thick line, which is wide, and thin line. All right, when you get done with this, you can go ahead and stop and worry about working next week. It was great working with you guys today, and I can't wait to talk to you next week.